In the latest news from Shadow, their Twitch news update showcased some of the most requested features. First, Eric, the CEO, mentioned Shadow would be continuing to focus on gaming while expanding their B2B operations. They did note that there are benefits to working with B2C and B2B products, especially in the latency area. So be assured, gamers won't be left in the dark going forward. Now with this, they mentioned their new gaming offers, but if you've seen our update over a month ago regarding the updates on these offers, they're the same thing. Feel free to check out that update video. This video would also include updates for makers and enterprise machines. Now for the new stuff. Shadow Drive might be out competing other cloud storage services. Currently, it is only in Europe, coming to the US soon, but Shadow Drive Premium has two terabytes for 499 euros a month. It's also easy to migrate from other services like Dropbox and Google Drive. Shadow has one of the long-awaited features now in beta, drag and drop. You can now drag and drop your files from your desktop to your Shadow machine. Files will go into your Shadow machine downloads folder. This is for desktop versions of the Shadow app and this is currently in beta and it's not finished. So there might be some bugs here and there. There's also things missing like no progress notifications. You'll also have to use the Beta Shadow app to use this feature. Now, for what I see as the most requested Shadow feature users have wanted for a while now. Browser support. Everyone clap. Now this is coming soon, but please note that the browser compatibility will be limited to 1440p and 60fps. PC.shadow.tech. They also recommend all major browsers, but primarily Chrome. They also recommend common gamepads like Xbox and PlayStation controllers. And finally, they had a Q&A, so feel free to check that out, but the one question that stood out to me was why the power upgrade isn't available in Texas yet. To put it simply, it's because they cannot water cool the data center. That with the current data center we have, we can't. Uh, and the reason for that is that we can't, we don't, we can't water cool the, the data center in, in, uh, in Texas right now. So that's the issue we have. We're looking into solutions in the US people because we want to provide a better service in all the territory, frankly. But uh, this is going to take a bit more time. But we're looking into solutions because we know, especially the south of the US, is not very well covered right now. Yeah. Well, that basically covers the Twitch news update. Let me know your thoughts on the news in the comments below. Now, if you're looking to get started with Shadow, you can get 15% off the base Shadow tier for the first month with the link in the description. If you like this news overview of Shadow, give us a like. Also, make sure to join as a member of the channel or join our Patreon in the links below. And above all else, make sure to subscribe to keep it locked right here at the only place where you can do battle in gaming heaven, Cloud Gaming Battle.